go to google type open file and select a website open file website go to, go to download here i already downloaded just to show you i click here that okay. here i have downloaded here you can see the open file to open file yeah. open work session right uh, create virtual machine new select the open file click next select the kernel linux kernel 64 bit and linux type the rename the folder or like open file and select the location but that default name select the 10 gb or 1 gb 10 gb is enough and you click finish and power on the virtual machine and press enter for graphical installation the graphical installation will be started click next next yes next place a configuration hello here we need to enable the IP address 10 dot I am giving some IP address and a separate mask also in the default gateway what you have assumed for the active directory press ok target the IP address for you whom you want to give the IP address but we later we can change also no problem add target press enter sorry press next press yes yes here you need to go edit why because we need to disable the DSCP why because every time we change the IP address we don't recognize right so we need to disable the IP address so here we we get the IP what we have given that okay uh, name any address I am naming here as a dot local and the type the default gate when the primary DNS once again once again select Kolkata and Asia according to your location type the root password and confirmation password press next after that press press next it will the format that disk what you have the given the size press reboot it will be restart the system after the restarting the system login as a root password what you have sent previously just uh, password, uh, password I have given so again login as a root type the password only thing is you need to shut down that uh, you can do that as power as a guest system type init space zero to shut down the system yes it will the shut down the open file why because we need to add multiple hard disk to the open file why because we are sh sharing the multiple lands right so we need to add the multiple land hard disk here so select uh, go to open file and select edit settings go to edit settings click hard so if you want to increase the ram select so the 1 gb is enough select the hard disk plus add and hard disk so add next so i guess is recommended press next next store virtual machine as one give the 10 gb or 8 gb whatever you want but 10 gb is enough for practicals and like that multiple hard disk now what we are doing means we are assigning multiple uh, hard disk to the open file in the real time we have uh, another uh, NAS say, folder for practices purpose we use NAS like this I am adding here four lunch means four hard disks 
after adding that in the open file only we have to need to format once again and we uh, formatted we have to group that formatted hard disks to the into volume groups and we need to create space ice case space so login to, to the web browser well, because i am in the same network here uh, that ip uh, what you have assigned to the one filer 15 i have assigned 443 is a uh, Recommended. If you want any doubts, you can see that in the what the administration uh, web URL for the open filer. Here you can see the uh, web address, web administration of open filer. Turn out something guys like there. Go to that port number. This is the open filer. By default, we have one password that is open file, press at once. By default, we have open filer, type open filer and password. We cannot log in as a root here. We have to log in with open filer and password is password only. Here, this is the by uh, open filer operating system information and hardware. Go to volumes. We have four disks, so we need to format that. Uh, here, we can see 000, 000 formatting types. So press zero, uh, dev as uh, one hard disk, and format with create partitions. Press create. So we have created ten uh, in a hard disk one partition. Now like that you have to do for all three lunch. Go to volumes, go to second second hard disk and create partition. Again go to second hard disk, third hard disk. Sorry order disk press come to down and create so we have <coughs> added that disk but the it's hard disk we need to format with the dps partition here all we can see the one 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 at that time after uh, creating partitions after that we need to group that volumes so mana volume go to here you can see all ones one partitions we will successfully created partition hard disk uh, of hard disk <coughs> go to value groups so here what uh, i am selecting all four four disk into value one means all we are i am grouping all four hard disk into one hard disk press value group so i have space how much space i want to take to expose the learn how much that much space I can take from here go to add value select the value from which you want to space type the value share the value mm. naming to recognize that select the value I am selecting total hard disk select the ice KC block click this ok right now we have completed and we need to map that go to services ice KC target clicks enable and start and okay that's it over go to volumes go to ice KC targets click add this is the uh, ice KC target go to learn map go to select ISL here set local networks here we need to enter the uh, name of ESXi or anything name and here I am sharing the network for means the LAN which is having 10 dot network that LANs uh, that ESXi can ac accept this uh, can use that LANs go to network SL allow update no need uh, LAN mapping is there already click update shut down log out ok that's it we have completed go to ESXi or vCenter select the go to configuration go to new storage adapter and click add soft case ad adapter select the adapter properties dynamic discovery click the dynamic discovery click add and give the open file IP address
well i will press ok after that oh close press scan here we have zero zero right path and it will turn into one go to storage add storage press next here the what the LAN as exposed to the ESXi why because we have given the total network right press next 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 use the name open file or anything name can be anything no no problem press next 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 that's it so we have taken the space from the open file successfully thanks for watching this video if you have any doubts comment in the video section bye